Hey there, my name is Promise. Welcome to more EU4, the Kingdom of God. We're playing as the Papal State. Nice, glorious Italian, but take some islands away from Aragon. Everything's looking all hunky dory. And we're looking for an opportunity to kill Milan, hopefully, before Castile decides to get involved in a war that I really would prefer they leave me alone on. If I. If I seem a little shell shocked right now, uh, it's because uh, after the last video, my wife just had to call me away and she's like, I need your help with something. Uh, I, I'm hoping I can explain to you guys more about this later, but for now, I just had to buy like an $11,000 piece of medicine and I'm not even kidding. Now, fortunately insurance covers some of it, but like, holy crap. <laughs> I'll explain more later. Maybe, if I can, we'll see. Um, but yeah, I my my brain my brain ain't in it right now. Uh, and there goes Savoy, son of a. Okay, uh, they annex Savoy. So now, when we do decide to take some stuff away, I have to actually take it from France, not Savoy, which means it's going to be a French core, which means they're going to be peeved at me and never want to be allies again. Great, so when I attack Siena, it's over, say goodbye to France forever, I might as well just say, screw it, I'm eating Provence! Or something, I don't know. Gosh, dang it, I'm gonna make an enemy of France for the rest of the dang game. Well, this gonna be fun. This gonna be so fun, yay, I love it, thank you. Can I have some more? Do you wanna go ahead and start working on the pal palace here? Yeah, kinda. I'm gonna, and the reason being, eventually I can get this to give me more governing capacity, and I'll be honest, governing capacity is like really good to have. Not to mention, more reform progress, like even after you finish all of your reforms, if you got leftover reforms, just keep popping the button to get more governing capacity, and all of a sudden you have more states, you gotta be a lot stronger, you gotta go kill more people and declare imperialism, and it's great. It's great. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna be able to get over this, I'll be honest. I'm not gonna be getting over this anytime soon. Baden has been eaten by Austria. Good. Stronger Austria equal more evil kill France. France has 107,000 troops now. How? What are you doing that is getting you so much force limit? What are you... I get my own force limit. Yeah! Yeah, you thought I wouldn't, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna go get my own dang force limit. By the way, I haven't forgotten that the Mamluks were fighting against the Ottomans, but it didn't last long, and... I mean, they've lost a lot of troops. It still wouldn't be perfectly easy to do, and I've lost my claims, unfortunately, but like, whatever, but, uh, yeah. The problem is if I... Ah, wait a minute. Frick! If I wait on this, the next war with the Ottomans, there's a very good chance they manage to snag Jerusalem next. And if that happens, I lose the Holy Trinity ex Oh, God. Okay, hang on. Hang on, 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 but I've got two tech levels on him. I could win a fight against this, yeah. Definitely. So let's go ahead and get some claims going. I am Papal Controller again, a 442. Outstanding? Nah, but good enough. Curia powers, absolutism, regimen drill losses, unrest in Catholic provinces could be good. Institutions, development costs, tolerance of heathens. Nah. Nah, I'm gonna go for uh, less unrest to worry about, thank you. So, the Berialis Allies of Mia are gonna have some issues. Uh, here's the thing, I don't really want to deal with this, so I'm just gonna go ahead and increase your autonomy and not worry about any rebellions, because I don't want to transfer over there. I got more important things to worry about right now. I would not like to reduce the autonomy here, or increase the autonomy here. If we wait a little bit longer, this goes away. I mean, heck, if I were willing, I could simply just reduce some more war exhaustion, and that would probably solve it. But whatever. I think 
Maybe I can still fight Milan quickly, but if it looks like that's not... Oh, Castile's going to join again. Dang it, they're not enough in debt. Okay. Uh, well, hmm. Hmm. War score cost versus other religions. Seems relevant. Make sure that I get Jerusalem a little bit easier. All right, so we no longer are going to be fighting against Milan yet. We have to wait for a better opportunity and or be ready to fight Castile again. For that, I might need France's help. I might be able to call them in on something. But France right now... Stand by. No longer desires me as an ally. Wait, yes, you do. There, see? Problem solved. Um, but yeah, not, not relevant this exact second. France, I really wish you would stop being so difficult on me. All right? I don't think I deserve the amount of vitriol that I'm getting out of all this. I really don't. Mamluks have allied Fazan next. Well, that's not relevant. It's 2,000 troops. Have fun. I guess with France's help, we could go ahead and just kill Milan real quick. I mean, we'll get a claim against them first. I guess we will. The thing is, like, the Mamluks obviously are getting a chance to rebuild, but, like, as long as I stay far ahead of them on tech, who cares? We'll win anyway. Regimental force camps are expensive, by the way. Like, 200 gold each. It's a little nonsense, really. But, all right. A few more months. Civil war in Ethiopia. No, Prester, no! Institution spread, work toward that monthly war exhaustion. Man, that's gonna be nice. It'll make it so much easier to sustain long wars like this. You want to take money from me? No. I mean, thank you, but also no. Why won't Austria join in on this, out of curiosity? Now France won't join. Why? You fighting another war again? Flanders, Brabant Conquest of Ghent. Oh, you got called in on an ally's puny, tiny little war. Okay. Well, once again, I find myself in a spot where I can't do... Mm! Anyway, Austria, why wouldn't you join on this? You're in debt. Oh, so if I paid off your debt, you might consider it. No, because of diplomatic reputation. But here's the thing. All right, hang on. Wait, wait, wait a minute. We can still do this. We can still do this. Here's what you do. Okay. We got lots of favors. I got 93 favors. If I were a monarch, it'd be like, hey, put my dynasty on your throne. Let's go for the personal union thing, you know? I'd do that. I'm going to ask you to prepare for war, which should give me 20 reasons for them to join in on a war, which overcomes the minus 17 that we had before. Waiting for just one more month. Muscovy declares war on box. Salt crisis? Oh, I'm about to give you all some salt. Y'all seen $11,000 medical bills? That brings out the salt! All right, Milano. That's the only one that I need. It's gonna be a lot of aggressive expansion, but such is the way of things. I call in Austria. This, by the way, is how strong we would be against France, for the record. I need to wait until the claim registers. There it is. We are about to have some problems. Now we call you in. Mantua? Who are you allied to? I don't really care about Coburg, but tell you what, for good measure, I'm gonna co belligerize you. There. Kill! Kill! Or don't. Fine. See Sham Mantua! We just stack wiped Milan! And now we're working on his two forts. The Italian Wars have begun, as they should be. All right, so Castile and Aragon are going to be annoying. We're going to kind of reset a truce timer with them. The sooner I can just get out of a war with them, the better. I don't really want to get involved. Um, You have three heavies. There's a bunch of galleys there. I'm just debating, if I put an admiral in here, could I kill you? I bet you I could. Well, not that admiral, obviously. Eh, better. Not much, though. I think I could win against this. He'll bring in reinforcements, but I've got 22 galleys. Yeah, look at that. Get crushed. Get wrecked. Get wrecked, Castile. Oh, sink those heavies down, baby. I barely took a scratch. 
That's what you like to see, yo! Hey! Alright, the real trick, once again, though, it... Mm, eight cardinals? How are you allowed to have eight? I'm only allowed to have seven. Enemy invasion. Imminent. Where? No, like, for real, though, where, actually? Armada, real... Oh, dang it! Discord! No! Lex! Stop telling people I'm a chicken in your stream! I know! I get it! Thank you! This. That's a naval invasion that's imminent? Well, it's 17 transports! Go get them! Uh, fort maintenance, lose devotion. Fine. Where is he? Where'd he go? Where'd he run to? Come here, Castile. There you are. I see you got 17, uh, transports. I'm gonna catch you and kill you. This is gonna be glorious. Get ready to... You escape. How did you escape? That's not allowed. You're not supposed to be allowed to escape. Bible has been translated. Lose reform desire and make a lot of people like me or... Well, yeah, no. Burn the priest who would dare to translate the Bible for the common man. Clearly meant only for the priesthood. Definitely not because it continues our papal power. Uh-huh, definitely not that. So, Austria's already sieging this down. They bought Condottieri, that's funny. We're just gonna go siege all this and say goodbye to Milan's new troops that he's training up, that he loves so much. But they're all dead. Hi, Mantua. You want out, do you? You know, if I took this, this would be sweet. Manageable. I eat Mantua. Can't. Well, fine. We wait for a little while longer then. But soon enough, I shall kill you. I am going to lay siege to the ports of Valencia. After I have a chance to dock up and repair for a month. There you go. And I'm doing this to give them more exhaustion. Better yet, we go to the Gulf of Leon and assist with the siege. Switzerland is also declaring war on Milan. You can pick winner after I'm done, Switzerland. I don't even want you having any of this. This is all Northern Italy. You do this and I will kill you. In case I wasn't clear. You take this, I kill you. I very kill. Probably. Oh, we can do some conversions. Let's convert those filthy Protestants. Oh, uh, how is this war going up here? Pretty good. Coburg's gonna die soon. That's good. Uh, Castile really is not committing many troops. I don't know where all their troops are, but they're not where I would need to worry about them. Where actually are they? Are they gonna try to find a way to sail up over here or something? A sailor went to CCC to see what he could see, 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 but the Pope shot him down in the Holy See, see, see. I don't know. I'm just trying to find funny ways to make that go. All right, we need claims against the Mamluks. We said we wanted to do that. Stand by it. Cyprus. There. I mean, I already had a claim with the Knights, but now I've got my own claim. There's Castile scaring away the Austrians. All right, well, we got that, so this is good. So we take all of you, and we move this way, and we take all of you, and we move this way. We're gonna try to find a way to scare you off at least long enough to get you the heck out of here. I don't really want anything from you anymore. Truth be told, I'm kind of done with you. Uh, Mantua, we can eat now, so I will. Thank you. Mine. This is a part of a state I already own. 190 Jasms. Okay, and if I wanted to take Milano right now, we can do that. And the coalition is there, but not insane. The more money I take, the longer the truce timer, the better. Unfortunately, it's not going to be fantastic. I don't really want to fight over all this. I'll just cost myself manpower I don't need. Take this. Done. I don't even think I have the uh, admin power for all of this, so that's fun. Yeah, 117. But I finished what I needed. So now we are literally one province away from becoming the kingdom of God and getting the achievement. 
We're that close. This is how close we are. We should be able to get the achievement this week. I have a hard time believing we won't. But, it's gonna be tough still. Let's get that army force limit nice and high. Need as many troops as possible. France sitting on 100,000 troops. Man, if you guys want to go to war against Great Britain, that would be great. Don't call me in on your wars, though. Oh, also, because I don't know if maybe someday you're going to get really angry with me. Can I have stuff? No. I could boost their trust some more. Uh, Mantua has a garbage fort. Throw it away. This fort's not exactly good either, but we'll live with it. So all of you, group up, split. Where are my other armies? There you are. Go ahead and move you guys down there. Move you guys down here. So, the goal is to go to war against the Mamluks, who is rebuilding an army. They're still only at Tech 9, though. They've got more allies, but I have all the cannons and I have the tech. So if we are careful, if we are careful, we should be able to win against them. And I have a lot more force limit. There we go. So let's get our armies together, see what we need in order to have two very functional uh, roaming stacks, and then we'll use them. We'll kill the Mamluks solo, snag Jerusalem, core it, and the ba ba boom, we have Holy Trinity. Then I just focus everything I've got on one chance to kill France. Snag a single province, and we'll have our second achievement. And the series could officially be over at that point. I mean, if people want it to be. I don't know, some people like these series to keep going for a long time. They're like, you used to play until the age of imperialism all the time. It was the meme that made us fall in love with you, promise. You have a t-shirt based around imperialism. Why no more imperialism? The answer is because EU4 is a long game and I can't keep doing like 60 episode series. <laughs> I can't do it. Doesn't make sense. It's not good for my business strategy. All right, so we can afford to get at least a couple more infantry and a cannon on each of these. So 16 to 13 is what I'm going for here. That leaves me with one extra force limit with which I will give, I don't know, another infantry. Flanking bonuses are still good. Technically, I shouldn't even get the cavalry right now. I should probably disband the cavalry and just have the cheaper infantry. But I never mind having a little cavalry. Just like a little bit to get that extra flanking bonus on the off chance you can outnumber and crush. It feels good to do it. Okay? So, Darna is the one that I wanted to have a claim on over here. I'll keep getting the spy network. Because you never know if maybe you can use that at some point to just get some siege value. But we'll try that. Um, since no one's running a coalition right now against me, the sooner we get these guys into positive so they're no longer outraged, the better to try and prevent a coalition from forming as soon as I start my own war. France, by the way, is apparently not looking to get rid of me as an ally, even though I'm not willing to join their uh, wars anymore. 38 months is a long time to be paying five ducats for Crete. What's your uh, unrest? It's at 5.5 right now. Yeah. If we do this, we will almost certainly have a rebellion at some point. But I'll live with it for now. We could, by the way, go ahead and just kill the Lucas Separatists before they become an issue. Because they're reformed. I can finally core Milano, so he will. Once you get rid of the Orb Extension, that'll help a lot. Um, I really wish I had a lot more manpower. Oh, we can do more seizing of land and stuff. Let's do that. Do a mission. Forens with the Manufactory, again. Regimental Corps or Conscription Center in Ravenna. Or Power in Ragusa. I'll probably build a manufactory in Ferenz. Why not? Seems fine. Hey, Teutons, you want to help with this? Salt Crisis again? All right. All right. Who's trolling me? Who's unleashing all the salty tears? Who's doing it? Who is it? Why am I also making so little money 
out of curiosity. Is it just the fact that I have this many more troops? Probably. Yeah, our maintenance will do it. Close to capped out on uh, stuff again. Oh, okay. Doop, 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 doop. I'm building them there, so I'll be incentivized to build myself some... There you go. To build myself some barracks later. Education for the poor. Why? Yes. Transfer troops to Crete. We want to be ready to go for a naval invasion around Darna, nice and quick. Truce with Britain has expired. That means that France might declare on them at some point. Not likely, because why? They have no advantage to doing so, but they could. I really want this. Man, it'd be nice. Even once you finish all the papal ideas, you get another 5% discipline on top of it. I mean, that's a pretty good bonus right there. It was pretty good. Hey, can we go ahead and land here and just deal with these Catholics? I mean, can they even break my vassal at this point? Convert the knights. They can't do anything. They can't enforce their demands. We might as well just get rid of that. Uh, ooh. Um, corruption, I guess. I hate doing that, but oh well. We close to getting another reform? Getting close. Secularization. Hmm. That doesn't sound like something the Pope Man would want. The saying doesn't sound like something Pope Man want to do. Pope Man, not the type of man who wants secular. Mm -mm. Okay, clergy lose some influence. Thank God they're not going above 100, so we aren't going to have an event there. I was afraid that I was about to add on plus 10. I was going to be very concerned. All right, so those troops are getting over there. They should be able to breach that pretty quickly. We're gaining 610 manpower per month. Pretty slow, ain't it? So, hi, Mamluks. How you doing there? I need a diplomat. Let's stop currying favors with France for a bit. So, you still only have tech level nine, huh? You don't happen to have like a fort on Cyprus, do you? You do, it's a fully maintained fort. We'll be better off, well, Better off, most likely, going for Darna as a ticking war score, even though it's more likely they'll be able to sneak back and get it. Um, we'll be better off over here. He'll have allies, but they're all kind of far away except for Vazan. I'm just curious if there's anyone to co-belligerize, but the answer to that is no. Okay, um, so do we go? The answer is yes, of course we go. We go. Now, attrition is gonna be- oh, hello. Attrition gonna be a little scary. Hello, you got a navy. What navy you got? Transports and a couple heavies. Means nothing to me, I will kill you. Losing a tiny bit of cash right now, but it's not that bad. We can siege this down real quick. This will be my ticking war score going. Cardinal Minister? Yes, please. Let's just dock up. It's faster than whatever else they're doing. So, I could go and siege down Fazan, but, like, why? I don't think I need to. I'd rather go ahead and sink the M Mamluk Navy, if we can. There we go. Get crushed. We lost a ship. He lost a few of his, though. Quite a few of his. I just want to destroy his naval power. There goes Naxos. Okay, we siege down Benghazi. And then we start pushing up toward wherever else. You guys dock up, because we need to pick up some troops. No, no, no. Whatever you're doing is way too slow. I don't want to lose money. Hang on. And also, I don't want to lose France for a second. Hang on. You're keeping these guys off my back. Okay, there we go. This is more what I wanted. Much faster. Okay, so we're transporting troops. France is no longer threatening to abandon me at a bad time. We'll pick up the rest, and then we'll have a lot of troops ready to go. Okay. Then, we go sink his navy. Could go even further on military tech, but I'm not doing that. 
Not yet, anyway. You guys, where's my siege general? You're my siege general. You guys go to Alexandria. Split some troops so we don't take an absurd amount of attrition, and go. Crush that navy. Steal a galley, even better. Get down here and provide some blockading. Okay, so far this is going according to plan. He might send some troops in after me, but we'll see. The age of Kandatieri is over. And nobody shed a single freaking tear. Wow, we breached that wall pretty quick. That's nice. More ideas? Monthly war exhaustion. Yas. All right, so now it's ticking down, even with the attrition we're taking. Which means back home, we're not going to have a lot of issues with unrest. And we don't lose siege ability and stuff like that. I mean, war exhaustion's just bad through and through. It is always so nice to get rid of that. So reminder to you, Mamluks. I said that I want things like Cyprus. I actually am going for the Holy Land. Okay. That is priority numero uno. I don't care what it takes. I will take these four provinces if I have to. Whatever forms the official state. Just these three then, fine. Gaza, Al-Quds, and Jaffa. Jaffa cakes. I'll take all of them, and I will freaking have Jerusalem by God. And once I core it, the world shall know that the kingdom of God is truly imminent. Yes, I see you staring at me with all your troops thinking, man, I wish I could go kill that guy, but he's just so strong and sexy. Say goodbye to your navy, by the way. I hope you weren't using that for anything. <laughs> uh, let's go over here to the Palestinian coast and just blockade a lot. Hi, leave these guys alone. Don't, 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 don't even think. Oh. Okay, just be safe. Let's back up a few troops. He's thinking about attacking me. He's not yet, but he's thinking about it. But I think he knows I have a tech advantage and my numbers make it pretty easy for me to crush. I can fight you over here in a desert and win. You're locked? With no reinforcements? Let's kill him! Get ready! There we go! See, look at that! Look at that! And I get a better general if it takes less attrition! Hey! Nicey nice! Now I do want to send some troops up here to Cyprus and siege that down, but... Not for a little bit. It's not top priority. Toledo is the seat of a cardinal. For once, Castile gets to have some cardinals, huh? You've lost my general? I just got this, boyo. Oh, not that one. Other one. Fine, whatever. Um. I'm not splitting the troops up yet. Not for a little bit. Too much still rides on getting this. There's his capital. All right, we're going to go for these two forts over here next. And with that done, we'll probably have everything I need, honestly. We converted Crete. Well, thank God, that's over. Could spend military power to speed this war up, but am I in a rush right now? Nope. Tell me we don't seriously have another center of reformation. Where are you? Where? <sighs> Parma? <laughs> Parma exists, and they converted to reformed, and their independence is guaranteed. What? I don't allow. Nye, I spy on you. I shall spy on you. You're converting all of my stuff. Frick you! <sighs> Whatever. It's fine. We just wanted to have a bit of religious disunity. That's probably okay. Hey, where did you guys come from? You're landing over here. How'd you even do that? Where's your navy? I don't know. Fine, go march through the Ottoman's lands. That's, I know where his army is now, so we can just go do whatever we want. Not even worried about it. Come on, just finish one of these sieges, thank you. Yep. You go to Cyprus. Kill him. He means nothing to me. Heresy and Helra. No heresy! Stop! Don't do it! We're out of manpower. Of course we are! Why wouldn't we be? Portugal is a world power. Mm -hmm. Well, the good news is we can start converting some of these reformists quickly again. That feels good. So we've sieged down Jerusalem. Pop into here in places like Gaza. Make his ships pop out and die. There you go. See? Okay, now we're sieging there. 
I want to go kill this stack if I could, but we'll lose a lot of manpower in the process. And Portugal allies with Castile immediately because, of course, they do. They're historic friends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Well, benign neglect. Manpower. I don't even care what province it is. Do it. Um, I'm going to blow it open. Let's speed this war up a little bit. I'm taking more losses than I accept. I'm going to see if I can scare him away. So he stops trying to siege this back. That is the third inherit of the game. Oh, wait, that's because they formed Spain. That doesn't entirely count. I think they probably just popped a mission and instantly finished that. Okay. I was about to say, three inherits is a little silly. All right, well, we can kill this. Screw it. Castile is not a world power. That's because there's Spain now. So, of course, they're not. Da da. Come on, get Cyprus and we're going to end this war. I'm pretty sure that's all I need. So, <clears throat> we're going to war against France with no manpower and against Poland, Lithuania, and everyone else. Uh, this is an unwinnable war for me. This is an absolute unwinnable war for me. I can't win this. I can't help with this one. I'm going to have to betray my alliance, which is a problem for a lot of people. Um, this really complicates my ability to fight France. Unless I can do it while they're actively fighting Austria. I'm sorry, Austria. This came at a bad time. France knew what they were doing. Is all I can say. They knew exactly what they were doing. We just lost so much trust. I have to build that back up. I need 50 opinion to even do that. I've lost 50 opinion for that. Dishonored alliance wants my provinces. We may not be able to get our alliance back with Austria, depending. I've got to find ways to build. Um, they're, they're angry with me. They're hostile now. I'm actively losing more and more reputation with them as I watch. Alright, well the good news is we finished with this, so advisor costs just got cheaper, which is going to make my money a little bit easier to work with. I can also go for policies including trade efficiency and including infantry combat ability. Um, oh god. I have burned a lot of bridges with that. But I couldn't fight France. There was no way. It could not be done. Alright, well we can take Jerusalem, Cyprus, Darna, Benghazi. Honestly, at this point, forget these. It's not important enough. Um, I either need to find a lot of new allies now... Or something. <sighs> Do I need to go to war against France now? Is this my only hope, my only opportunity right now, is to go to war against Siena and France and take the one province I need? When no manpower exists? I have to slack in standards. That'll help. That gets me back up to full reinforcements, but it doesn't help me much beyond that. 
The alternative here is start recruiting generals with the intention of just getting them and firing them since I have military tech. Of course, we could just go for this early, and I think I may have to. We got a few months to get this set up, so I don't need to do it right now, but I need to do it in a few months, get the better infantry. Try to have a tech advantage over France and pray. So they want me to now choose their side instead. Nope. I has officially burned bridges with everyone. And Bohemia is now the Curia controller. What fantastic timing that is. Oh man, everything just went suddenly very badly. Question. Anyone want to be friends? Ethiopia. Cute. I'll take that alliance on the off chance we can use them against the Mamluks someday and expand out an empire in Alexandria. Um, my only consolation here is that I am about to get Holy Trinity. I'm over my time. We need to end this video. I think I have to go to Fran the War of France now. And I mean now. But France won't even defend anymore. Damn. If I insult them... That... That might be. If I insult them so they dislike me, they'll defend Siena, and I can call them in. Alright, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If so, I would ask you to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.